Thank you for joining me today in my conversation with Keone Kealoha, who is the executive director for Kanu Hawaii. Aloha. Kanu has been around for a very long time. And as executive director, please explain a little bit more where we are today with that organization. Sure. Well, Kanu Hawaii was founded 2007 by 40 people who came together to say, what can we do to make Hawaii a better place? I think all those founders have kind of moved on to pretty prominent positions in the community, but we still keep that mantra. That's still the core of what's driving us and, and the kinds of programs and projects that we're focusing our energy on today. And the vision is, remains the same. It is, yeah. I mean, we're looking at how do we engage individuals in, in making a personal commitment to a positive future for Hawaii. Okay, can you explain a little further what mm -hmm. that positive change is and that, that personal commitment? What would that look like? Kanu has done things in local food, renewable energy, waste stream diversion, civics, voting, registration, volunteer work. I don't think we're tied down to any particular area. What we're looking for is ways to make a difference around issues that our community is concerned about. What I've experienced also being in working with volunteers and in the community is that when a person commits to something, when they get engaged to help other people, actually it helps themselves as well. When you take an action and you, you get that feeling, right? It's, it's actually a physiological sensation of, of doing the some, something good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right, the serotonin rush right. that you get. An interesting thing about that is that whether you're performing and doing it yourself or you witness it happen, you have the same physiological reaction. And, and those things encourage you to say, hey, this is a good thing, maybe I should participate. So I think what Kanu has always tried to do is uh, engage people in a way that it makes it easy for them to take action. But then it's, it's also we kind of roll up everybody's individual impacts and, and say, together, like, look at what we can accomplish. So this, these are the collective impacts that we can make when we get 1,000 or 2,000 or 5,000 people together taking some kind of action. Could you just briefly explain what one or two of those initiatives might were in the past and where you're going now? Well, originally, Kanu Hawaii started off with an I will campaign. And the, the I will was kind of an open-ended, what, what is your commitment, your personal commitment? And so over 13,000 people uh, registered in that campaign, uh, and they made over 1,500 individual commitments. What is your main focus at the moment? Well, we've got a couple. Uh, one, speaking of the voter piece, you know, uh, Kanu's done work in, in voting uh, participation registration in the past. And I think we continue to look at that as part of our civic engagement uh, focus areas. So yeah, we'd like to figure out how do we get more people to show up? And you know, it's, there's the Automatic Voter Registration Coalition that's working on that. There's a vote by mail that's happening this year. But we also need to look at our midterm and long-term, like how are we raising the floor on the number of people that show up? The last five general elections were in last place. We're 51st out of, you know, everybody. So I know we can do better. And looking at the, specifically the volunteers, you have yeah. an event coming up. Right, so Volunteer Week Hawaii is an opportunity for all of our organizations, our businesses and, and people, residents and visitors across Hawaii to participate in some kind of service during National Volunteer Week, which this year is April 19th to the 25th. It also coincides with the 50th anniversary of Earth Day. So. We're encouraging people to get involved. If you, right now, if you'd like to host an event during the week, what we're doing is trying to drive more traffic to the organizations that want to participate. We're shooting for 150 events across Hawaii during the week. Last year, we had 130, so we're not too far off, but we'd love people to you know, visit volunteerweekhawaii.org and you can get all the information you need to participate. Linking and interacting and um intersecting all of our volunteers. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Appreciate it, it's exciting. Yeah. yeah, it's great. Thank you for being with us. Sure. Mahalo for tuning in. We've had a conversation with Kione Kealoha, who is the executive director for Kanu Hawaii. Mahalo.